Alright, hey guys, what's up? Apple Fanatic here, and today I'm going to be showing you how to hack your iPod Nano 6G. This was released a while ago, but I thought I'd do a tutorial on it today because I have nothing better to do. So, you're going to need a couple programs. You are going to need, first off, a iPod Nano 6G. You are going to need firmware 1.0. I'm going to drag it to my desktop. Uh, link will be in the description for it. If you've updated to 1.1, just download it. Download this. Um, and that's pretty much it. Now, you're going to have to know how to show hidden folders and f files on your, device, um, com your Windows computer, but I'll show you how to do that also. So let's get started. So once you've downloaded this, it should say iPod 1.0. You're going to go up ahead and open up iTunes. And you are going to hit no. Um, if your iPod's already set up, make sure you back it up. Mine's not, so I'm going to hit done. Now you're going to want to go to shift restore. Go to wherever you have saved your firmware, 1.0. Hit enter. And it's going to extract the software. and your iPod should be restored. We're going to hit OK now. And at this point you can exit out of iTunes. Now you're going to want to go up to computer and this is the, oops, sorry, the computer control panel and this is where you're going to enable to show hidden files and folders. So you're going to go over to folder options, double click it, go to view and hidden files and folders. You're going to hit show hidden files, folders, and drives. You're going to click that. Then you're going to want to go down to where is it? Show um Actually, that's the only one you have to select. All right. So once you've selected that, you're gonna hit OK. All right. So once you have enabled the um, ability to see hidden folders on your device or on your computer, um, you're just gonna want to go over to my computer, select your iPod. Con you're gonna now have the ability to open up iPod Control device and you're going to go down to icon.plist and you're going to hit open if for whatever reason you don't have a um, notepad you just hit open with and you should be able to select notepad so I'm just going to double click open up as as the plist oops where did it go oh, let's try that again and now we're going to go over to now playing and we'll go over to playlist and we will delete this string and we will delete the artist string just to show you that it in fact going to work and Now we're going to hit file, save, so we can save it. You can now exit out of it. And we're going to do a hard reboot on the iPod. And how you do that is you hold the minus and the on off button until it turns off. It is now going to flash and you're going to want to unplug it. Oh, I failed at that.
And as you can see, we are now missing the artists and the now playing. So guys, I hope you enjoyed the tutorial.